Now we have, after a long time, DPRIN. Violet Crazy, Dear Insanity. Don't ask me how was the 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 storytelling that he was. Uh, is I, I remember in another video that someone of you have left a comment with the explanation. Please uh, do it again because in this moment I don't remember the the, the storytelling of uh, everything. I remember that that um, he is uh, bipolar the dear insanity is the other part of him uh, but pff, i have really few uh, hints uh, about the the storyline let's say so yes let's see let's listen okay guys quick message if you want to request me something you can uh, use the second link in the description so yes uh, let's go to the video He, he does always R&B. R&B. This is R&B. How is oh, my God? Ooh. He has an amazing voice. Good violence. I think we're all, all, all violence. How is called this type of song? Uh, like, uh, it's nostalgic. Uh, the the vibe is nostalgic. Uh, I feel it's R and B. But I, I, I don't think he's a straight R&B because it reminds me also the vibe of Vaporwave. And you know what what else reminds me? Georgie. Jo Georgie is not someone that I listen. I know who is Georgie. I know Filthy Frank. But I listen only... I listened. I heard only one song or maybe two from, uh, from him. And... Uh, Reminds me of what DPR uh, do. Even how he is using the voice now, and obviously the instrumental. I, I, I don't know how they are called every uh, how is called every instrument uh, here because there is a uh, I suppose there is a trumpet uh, but there are other other instruments uh, that I don't know the names. Well, I, I didn't say nothing. They are placed in the best way possible. He's really so particular how how he uses uh, his voice. Uh. I, I said so many times that he is unique, uh, but I mean that uh, because uh, in. Uh, The scene of Cape. Ah, oh, God. In 
the scene of K-pop, Don't Go Insane. My god, really cool, god, Don't Go Insane. Oh no, it's not finished. <laughs> really majestic. It's finished. Yes, it's finished. Uh, in the K-pop scene, uh, there is no one similar to him that I know. Maybe, maybe there is someone that does uh, similar, but until now I didn't see nothing uh, similar to his music. And uh, this is a great plus. Uh, this is a really great plus. What? Uh, I will, I will see one moment uh, the uh, vi violet crazy meaning. But actually, I don't know if I will understand some. Hmm. So, as uh, I, I don't know if uh, I'm saying something right, as I, um, I remember that he, how he he tell a story in a in a song is with the uh, uh, storytelling of a relationship. If, and if I remember well, and even in this case, and I think that the relationship is a is a sort of uh, a sort of strategy to uh, to explain the relationship that he has with his problem of uh, of uh, being bipolar. I, I don't know. You have to let me know in the comments uh, the situation uh, in uh, this song uh, and the references uh, with the others uh, with the other songs uh, because I don't remember nothing. And uh, yes, uh, the DPR is one of those artists that I every time I check something about him uh, is a uh, is always good music. I don't know. Maybe I will not like a song, but I will. You will not listen. Never. Probably this is a bad song. This was a really cool song. Let me know in the comments what you think about the song, uh, even the situation, the storytelling uh, thing. If you like this video, leave a like, subscribe, check out the description if you want to support my work and make a request. And uh, yes, alla prossima.